Hi, my name is Ellie and I am the voice of the Virtual Grid Construction Game. Why does a video game need a voice? Because narration makes it more accessible for children of all ages. Students can learn about electricity while engaging in fun hands-on challenges. Students can also learn how electricity works in the real world. There are 10 different challenges followed by a free play. In free play, you can apply what you learned and make your own grid. There are easy to follow directions in each challenge. The first challenge is connecting a power plant to a factory. This was one of the first milestones in the history of the electrical grid. The second challenge adds nearby customers. This was the next milestone in the electrical grid. Light bulbs were safer and more convenient than gas lamps. The third challenge uses low voltage poles to carry power short distances. The fourth challenge uses transformers to carry power longer distances. Transformers and high voltage electricity are needed to carry electricity longer distances. The fifth challenge introduces three phase power. Large customers like factories require a steadier stream of electricity. The sixth challenge brings power to a larger community. You can add any buildings you want. During the storm phase of this challenge, it is easy to see how one broken wire can be hard to find in a large city. The seventh challenge adds smart meters. Here you can see how smart meters work in the real world. They make it easier to restore power when storms bring down power lines. The eighth challenge involves balancing loads. In this challenge, you rearrange wires to direct power from different power plants. There are easier ways to balance loads though. The ninth challenge adds switches. Here you can use switches to balance loads and bypass problems caused by storms. The final challenge is automating the grid. This combines smart meters and switches to show you how power companies are getting closer to eliminating power outages forever. Throughout your experience, unfamiliar words can be defined by tapping on them. The virtual grid construction game can be found at smartgridforall.org. For teachers of grades 4 and up, curricula are available to expand the game's ideas.